Welcome back to Monroe's Corner. <laughs> I'm your boy Monroe. This is my little corner. <laughs> Hey, welcome back, Cone Squad. What's good, man? Shit, we back. Yeah, you know I mean, we back. We back. We back. Hey, appreciate everybody uh, leaving the suggestions in the comment. That's how you know what I'm saying. That's how things work out here. You put in your order at the corner store. You know what I'm saying? You put in your order at the corner store, man. You know what I'm saying? I whoop it up for you. All right, all right. So, uh, make sure y'all like this video. Um, our our first goal on this channel is to get to a thousand subscribers. That's to get the channel monetized and help your boy out greatly. Um, so, uh, so, so go ahead, like this and uh, subscribe. All right, all right. So today we got some more George Carlin. Uh, George, so we're doing George Carlin. Why we aren't ready for extraterrestrial intelligence? This is gonna be good. I already know. Let's get it. Now, just to change the subject a little bit, do you realize? Do you realize that right this second, right now, somewhere around the world, some guy is getting ready to kill himself? Isn't that great? Isn't that great? Do you ever stop and think about that kind of shit? I do. It's fun. And it's interesting. And it's true. Right this second, some guy is getting ready to bite the big bazooka. Because statistics show that every year a million people commit suicide. A million. That's 2,800 a day. Damn. That's one every 30 seconds. <laughs> there goes another guy. I think about stuff like that. It's interesting to me, like I said, certain things are interesting. Suicide's interesting. Life is filled with interesting things. That's why I could never commit suicide. I'm having too much fun. Keeping an eye on you folks. Watching what you do. Human behavior. That's what I like. Humans do some really interesting things. Like besides killing ourselves, we also kill each other. Murder. And we're the only ones who do that, by the way. We're the only species on Earth that deliberately kills members of our own species for personal gain. Mm. Or pleasure. Sometimes it's just fun. We're also the only species that deliberately kills members of another species for personal gain or pleasure. That's what hunters do. They kill for pleasure. That's us. Human beings. Interesting folks. Murderers. Here's an interesting form of murder we came up with. Assassination. You know what's interesting about assassination? Well, not only does it change those popularity polls in a big fucking hurry, but it's also interesting to notice who it is we assassinate. Did you ever notice who it is? Stop to think of who it is we kill. It's always people who've told us to live together in harmony and try to love one another. Jesus, <laughs> Gandhi, Lincoln, John <laughs> Kennedy, Bobby Kennedy, Martin Luther King, Medgar Evers, Malcolm X. Always. Evers, they all said, try to live together peacefully. Bam! Right in the fucking Facts. Head. Facts. All facts. Apparently, we're not ready for that. We've got to be the most interesting critters on the planet. And then we wonder why a UFO doesn't just land and say hello. <laughs> now, in case you're wondering why I have a certain interest in fascination. <laughs> Facts! We're so fucking savage! Why would a UFO just stop down and be like, hey, how you doing? You know what I'm saying? How the hell are, how the hell are you? You know what I'm saying? Nah, he... He, he coming down with bad intentions because he see what's going on. Like, if they doing that to their to they own kind, what the fuck they going to do to us? Let's call it. With torture and beheadings and uh, all of these things I've mentioned. It's because each of these items reminds me in life, every time I, one of them occurs, it reminds me over and over again what beasts we human beings really are. You know... When you get right down to it, when you get right down to it, human beings are nothing more than ordinary jungle beasts, savages. No different from the Cro-Magnon people who lived 25,000 years ago in the Pleistocene forest eating grubs off of rotten logs. 
No different. Our DNA hasn't changed substantially in 100,000 years. We're still operating out of the lower brain, the reptilian brain, fight or flight, kill or be killed. Now, we like to think we've evolved and advanced because we can build a computer, fly an airplane, travel underwater, we can write a sonnet, paint a painting, compose an opera, but you know something? We're barely out of the jungle on this planet. Barely out of the fucking jungle. What we are is semi-civilized beasts with baseball caps and automatic weapons. In case you haven't heard, the latest disaster for the rest of the universe is that the United States is going to go to Mars. Okay? Oh, yeah. We're going to go to Mars. And then, of course, we're going to colonize deep space with our microwave hot dogs and plastic vomit, fake dog shit and cinnamon dental floss and lemon-scented toilet paper and sneakers with lights in the heels. <laughs> and all these other impressive things we've what's, done. What's those fucking, uh... What they had? Was it the L.A. Gears was the uh, first joints to light up and shit? With L.A. Gears and the Heelys? Down here. But let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. What are we going to tell the Intergalactic Council of Ministers the first time one of our teenage mothers throws her newborn baby into a dumpster, huh? How are we going to explain that to the space people? How are we going to let them know that our ambassador was only late for the meeting because his breakfast was cold and he had to spend half an hour punching his wife around the kitchen? And what are they going to think when they find out it's just a local custom that over 80 million women in the third world have had their clitorises forcibly removed in order to reduce their sexual pleasure so they won't cheat on their husbands? Can't you just sense how eager the rest of the universe is? Motherfuckers do that shit! Damn! Is for us to show up. <laughs> Can't you see them out there? They put me onto some new shit. I ain't know this shit. <laughs> I ain't know this shit happened. <laughs> Yo, man, George Collins was a mastermind. You know what I'm saying? And and and, and he educated people through laughter. You know what I'm saying? That that, that it was just genius, man. Damn, that's that that was amazing. It's like, wow. Yeah, I'm definitely digging into his catalog. Uh, suggest more in the comments, please. Suggest more in the comments. This was this was this was a good one. This was a good one. The hell, whole shit. Like we wonder why the the aliens wouldn't come down and greet and just like, hey, yeah, we fucking savages, yo. All right, man. Pray for the world. <laughs> Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe, man. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> On the road to a thousand, all right? Peace. Love y'all.